In the late 12th century, walls that had stood for generations begin to crack because something simple finally gives way. A wooden arm pivots downwards as a box of stone drops under its own weight. The trebuchet works by storing energy as height rather than tension. Masons stack a counterweight high, release a pin, and gravity pulls it straight down, forcing the long arm to rotate around a fixed axle. As the short end falls, the long end accelerates faster than gravity alone, whipping a sling that keeps the stone lagging behind until centrifugal force snaps it free at a repeatable angle. This delay matters because it converts steady downward mass into controlled forward velocity instead of wasteful shock. Before this, attackers relied on twisted ropes that fatigued and snapped. Now they reset by lifting weight, not rewinding fibre. Crews adjust range by changing mass or sling length, learning to measure distance and timing instead of strength. Castles respond by thickening bases and angling walls, while the same falling mass principle later reappears in pile drivers and drop hammers that still shape construction today. For more stories about history, follow Time Prime History.